देखो अमार इंसान को अगर अपनी वर्थ का नहीं पता होता ना एंड इफ यू डोंट स्टैंड अप फॉर योर ओन सेल्फ नो बडी इज गोन स्टैंड अप फॉर यू so you forget mm-hmm. about people doing something for you you forget the government you forget your organization you forget mm-hmm. your management you forget your peers what are you mm-hmm. doing for yourself yeah what what is your excuse <laughs> if you feel that you are worth it and you're still in the same organization either you make a courageous de- uh, decision of you know shifting away yeah. or you change your strategy or don't complain mm-hmm. because people will always abuse you people will use you and throw you away discard you like a used pe- uh, piece of paper if you don't stand up for yourself that is there nahi aapko main mazey ka ek cheez batati hu vital science ki main bahut badi fan hu i have always been a huge fan of vital science their music junee jab shed right so one of my favorite tracks by vital science happens to be do pal ka jeevan it's a very inspirational song yeah. and junee uh, junee jab shed ye kehte hain ke haroge तो हारो ना हारोगे तभी तुमको मजा आएगा जीत का अंजल एनालिस यू डोंट फील यू डोंट फॉल डाउन यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू एंजॉय स्टेपिंग अप एंड मार्चिंग अ हेड एंड एंजॉइंग सक्सेस आई हैड द प्रिविलेज ऑफ होस्टिंग अ शो फॉर जुनेद साहब और मुझे आज तक उसका इम्पैक्ट मैं फील करता हूँ बिकॉज आई वॉज ऑन स्टेज विद हिम इट इज अज लाइक नथिंग एल्स क्योंकि मुझे उसका ना इम्पैक्ट याद है आज तक मुझे आप काम डाउन हो जाते हो आप मुझे सिरेनिटी आ जाती है एंड सिरेनिटी दैट स्टेज सो इट स्टेड विद मी आई हैव सम अंडरस्टैंडिंग सम सम फीलिंग्स ऑफ इट लेफ्ट विद मी इवन लाइक मतलब मेरा ख्याल है इट्स बिन ओवर ट्वेल्व ईयर्स और इलेवन ईयर्स बट इट डज हैव एन इम्पैक्टन सो यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट एवरी मीडियम इज डिफरेंट द डिजिटल स्फेयर इज डिफरेंट टी वी इज डिफरेंट वीडियो इज डिफरेंट राइट रेडियो में अगर आपके पास पैशन नहीं है और कंसिस्टेंसी नहीं है तो आप रेडियो नहीं कर सकते द ओनली रीजन आई वन ऑफ द लास्ट आई थिंक लास्ट पीपल स्टैंडिंग हेयर ऑन द रेडियो साइड इज बिकॉज आई हैव बिन कंसिस्टेंट एंड बिकॉज आई एम क्रीज मी अबाउट द रेडियो बिकॉज रेडियो में आपको आवाज का जो एक जादू है वो सिखाया जाता था जो बोलने का अंदाज है जो डायलॉग डिलीवरी है द पावर ऑफ द माइक गिव्स यू द कॉन्फिडेंस टू रूल द वर्ल्ड मैन यू कैन हैव you might anywhere in the world and you can be super confident true, right true, true, true. your tiktok tiktok's not going to help you i'm sorry but the mic is definitely going to help you because the yeah. mic will train you then yeah. the mic will be your mentor mm-hmm. so i would say to the students that please i radio mein sikhe audio work sikhe music sikhe content creation sikhe programming sikhe audience se baat karna sikhe aur patience or consistency ke sath chale taki you can create your own brand assalamu alaikum everyone this is amar bin salim welcome to another episode of out loud with amar this is season 3 and we are into episode 8 we are getting close to the end of this season as well today i am privileged to be hosting this session with a with one of the finest and most thickly followed media personalities in Pakistan and uh, amongst other things her events and her philanthropic work and social work she is very well known for the work that she does for FM 91 records uh, drive time with Sophie very very delighted to have you Sophie how are you It's my pleasure. Assalamu alaikum Amar. Thank you so very much for inviting me. Um thank you for the lovely introduction but I just want to mention one thing. Sure. That I've literally been stalking you. Okay, since the time that you actually reached out to me and I want to mention the fact that I love your guest list. I love your content and I think that you have a really bright future. So all the best. Thank you. Thank you very much. I mean these words coming from you is is a matter of huge honor for me. Honestly. straight from the heart my pleasure thank you <laughs> so uh, sophie i'm going to take you back to your very early days and fir uske baad we're going to you know get critical about media and we're going to get into very serious stuff but usse pehle and itna sakht ho jaye discussion let's first talk about your early days what was your school like and what has living living in lahore been for you or college kis tarah se tha university and then how did you decide you're going to work for work in the media radio pe to baad mein aate hain बचपन के दिन बड़े अच्छे थे दिन जवानी डेज 
कितने अच्छे थे दिन आई नो यू जस्ट मेड मी टेक अ ट्रिप डाउन द मेमोरी लेन अमार आई टेल यू समथिंग यू नो आई हैव बीन वन ऑफ दोस फॉर्चूनेट इंडिविजुअल्स इन लाइफ हु हैव हैड एन अमेजिंग चाइल्डहुड माशाल्लाह माशाल्लाह टच वुड आई रिमेंबर माय चाइल्डहुड वाज फिल्ड विद लाफ्टर विद लव विद म्यूजिक विद फूड विद फैमिली एंड आई वाज सो क्लोज टू माय कजिंस वी वर लाइक वी जस्ट we were basically raised together so hame aisa lagta tha hum sare behan bhai i am the only uh, daughter um, oh. and i just have one elder brother who's like 11 years older than me so literally mere chote abba hai but he lives uh, abroad <laughs> so my school life was full of uh, energy because i was a very energetic student i mm-hmm. was always into debates and sports and extracurricular and drama stuff like that so you would always see sophia somewhere near the stage either yeah. dancing or making the announcements or the one who's taking care of the students you know like you okay. could say she was the team leader so i guess my mom used to tell me mama mujhe batati hai ki you know utte jab aap bachon ko pehli dafa school chhodte hain to bade bam 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 karke rote hain ki acha ummi abbu ke bagair rehenge but you know she said ki you were such a social animal <laughs> that the minute we dropped you off at school you were like okay bye i see you later guys and i was just off you know i was making friends i was just you know yeah. chatting in baby language with my with my friends over there Achha. so i guess that answer to your question was that i was always uh, interested in communication so it came naturally to me even as a kid yeah. um that's why to uski reason ye hai because you were like happy at home and you wanted to get out of your home because kuch bachche aaj ke bachche bhi hote hain wo just like hum to yahan se jaye hum to yahan se nikle hain bhai I know, but you know, I'll tell you something. So, um, my uh, house was more or less this kind of thing that uh, my family is full of like engineers and professors and doctors, and I was the one who wanted to get into the media side. So, my childhood was like that. In my house, Hollywood movies were being watched, Pakistani songs were being listened to, Bollywood music was being listened to. So, it was a bit of everything rolled into one, right? And then um, I just had. Uh, a great childhood i saw the best of tv shows the best of movies the best of cartoons and now when i think about my childhood i can safely say alhamdulillah that i have been blessed to have wonderful parents friends and my family mashallah yes. well, it's so important i i think it was dhoop kinare and i've also been i've also been a, a huge fan a huge admirer of pakistan television and the work that they have done in the past and whatever they're still doing mashallah but mujhe yaad distinctly remember धूप किनारे में एक दफा देखा उसमें एक डायलॉग था कि बच्चों को ना बेपनाह प्यार देना चाहिए क्योंकि उनकी पर्सनालिटी जो है वो उससे बनती है नाउ आई रियलाइज बिकॉज आई जब मैंने अपना करियर स्टार्ट किया वो टीचिंग और उस वक्त वो बहुत सारी ट्रेनिंग वगैरह पता चला कि यार जो आप शुरू में बच्चे के साथ चार पांच साल में कर देते हो ना इट हैज लास्टिंग इम्पैक्ट लास्टिंग इन देंस इट हैज लाइफ लॉन्ग इम्पैक्ट लाइक नाइनटी परसेंट या सो उसकी ब्रेन डेवलपमेंट हो जाती है उस वक्त तो वो प्यार मिलना अबंडेंस में बड़े होना इज इज अ ह्यूज ब्लेसिंग एंड प्रिविलेज इन पाकिस्तान it is it is and i'll also tell you something वैसे तो कहते हैं कि first 5 years at the foundation of any child's life but i'll tell you something the biggest mistake we make is ye to bachcha hai isko kuch pata nahi hai isko to kuch samajh nahi aani we don't know wo jo ek bachcha jo tender mind hai na uske samne jo ho raha hota hai na usko zindagi bhar wo cheez yaad rehti hai Yes, the traumatic yes. experience that child would remember that joyous occasion that child would remember yeah. you asked me about my college and university so from my school to my college and university so i was in lgs and i was in kanade i had the best of time amar because i was very active mm. I, i gelled with the students i gelled with the teachers i was just high on life you know and yeah. i was just raring to go acha maine ye karna hai my class representative bhi thi aur main har jagah extra curricular mein thi i was an average student i'll tell you that pass mein ho jati thi but impression aisa yeah. hota tha that she's a brilliant student because i was so active all the time इसकी You know, I'll tell you something because what that guy is that we feel somehow that if you uh, as a student academically very good, then you are going to excel in your practical field. 
That is a misconception. You can and you cannot. You Achha, may and ah. you may not. Because mm-hmm. that is no guarantee. So, ये होता है कि आपका जो skill है, ये जो एक natural talent है, ये जो flair है ना आपका, that will take you a long way. And if you can cushion that forward, you are set for life. मगर just to correct you. I was not a bad student. I'm a gold medalist also. I was a lucky student. No, I'm sure. Yeah. So, absolutely. Uh, like that. 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 थिंक अबाउट इट and i think introspection is very important so you unlearn every day introspection i think introspection is the key word yeah. here because you have to acha ye aa jati hai na cheez is tarah se like matlab ek ek dafa aise lagta hai ki yaar acha matlab aapne masters wagaira bhi kar liya hai you have a fair understanding of the way world and the office works and the people work yeah usko aap kehte ho yaar there is not much to learn now aur humne wohi jo hai na wohi cheeze jo hai repeat pe karte rehna so it's it's not everyone's it's it's not easy for everyone to keep on learning and learning new things and have the patience with that yes absolutely i think you word you used a very key word over here patience and i also feel that we should you know the day we say that we know everything is the day yeah. we fail oh that is the day we fail exactly because we can't know everything we always learning from others and from ourselves also so ye to ek zindagi aapko sikha deta hai na धोखा आपको सही सिखाता है जिंदगी में जो धोखा आपको एक्सपीरियंस सिखाता है ना वो कोई किताबे नहीं अच्छा मैं सबके सामने कोई मिला तो नहीं है धोखा तो आपको पता है ऊपर नीचे आगे पीछे हर जगह इंसान को मिलता है एंड इट्स गुड आई थिंक वी शुड गेट टू इट इन ऑर्डर to learn and excel in life very important ye na ho log dhoka dhoonde nikal jaye yaar kahan se milta hai nahi aapko main mazey ka ek cheez batati hu vital science ki main bahut badi fan hu i've always been a huge fan of vital science their music junee jab shed right so one of my favorite tracks by vital science happens to be do pal ka jeevan it's a very inspirational ah. song yeah. and junee uh, junee jab shed ye kehte hain ke haroge to haro na हारोगे तभी तुमको मजा आएगा जीत का अंजल एनालिस यू डोंट फेल यू डोंट फॉल डाउन यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू एंजॉय स्टेपिंग अप एंड मार्चिंग अ हेड एंड एंजॉइंग सक्सेस Absolutely. Oh, vital science तो खैर जुनेद जमशेद की तो खैर क्या ही बात है मैं तो अल्लाह ताला उनके दर्शात बुला कर माय आई हैड द प्रिविलेज ऑफ होस्टिंग अ शो फॉर जुनेद साहब और मुझे आज तक उसका इम्पैक्ट मैं फील करता हूँ बिकॉज आई वॉज ऑन स्टेज विद हिम फॉर वन आवर टू आवर्स तो दिस वॉज बैक इन एफ सी सी वन आई वॉज स्टूडेंट देर सो सो ही हैड काम और मैंने उनका जो है शो होस्ट किया था तो इट इज इज अक नथिंग एल्स क्योंकि मुझे उसका ना इम्पैक्ट याद है आज तक मुझे आप काम डाउन हो जाते हो आप मुझे सीरेनिटी आ जाती है एंड दिनिटी एंड दिनिटी दैट स्टेज So it stayed with me. Yeah. I still have some understanding, some some feelings of it left with me. Even like, I mean, I feel it's been over twelve years or eleven years, but it does have an impact. I can so relate to that, Amar. I'll tell you something. So I hosted a show on TV. Uh, I used to host shows on PTV World and PTV Home as well. So PTV World pe mera ek English based show hota tha, Weekend World with Sophie. So that na after a hiatus of I don't know how many years, I did a reunion of Vital Signs. समथिंग ही कैप्टन टच विद मी 
मुझे आपके भाई और भाभी का ख्याल आया बिकॉज आई टोल्ड इम अबाउट माई भाई एंड भाभी एंड ही सेट के मैं उनके लिए दुआ कर मतलब ऐसा आपका कनेक्शन बनता नहीं है लाइक किसी से भी एंड यू डोंट एक्सपेक्ट टू रिमेंबर यू और टू रिमेंबर योर फैमिली मेंबर्स स्पेशली ऑन अ ट्रिप लाइक दैट एक्जेक्टली एंड आई सेड व्हाट अ ग्रेट मैन एंड वी लॉस्ट सच अ लेजेंड एंड एवरीवन हैज अ डिफरेंट एसोसिएशन विद हिम इट कुड बी बिकॉज़ ऑफ म्यूजिक इट कुड बी बिकॉज़ ऑफ हिज बयान इट कुड बी अबाउट एनीथिंग एल्स फॉर दैट एक्जैक्टली मतलब आप आपके लिए आप कहते हो कि हां यार उस बंदे का चेंज आया तो अल्लाह ताला ने उसको इसी से प्लेस किया I didn't know him from before. Matlab, like, didn't know him in the sense that I hadn't met with him uh, from uh, before his the bleak days. So, meet him once more. But after that, he was gone. So, I saw him after that. But time he did come. But but still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But still, I have talked to him from before. But uh, <laughs> now uh, coming back to your radio journey, the bit, I mean, like I know you've told me that you loved being close to the stage. And I feel like this is the thing that we, 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 <laughs> तो वो मतलब मैम आई कैन आई कैन रिलेट टू दैट मगर रेडियो पे कैसे एंड किया लाइक मतलब इट वाज इट राइट आफ्टर योर मास्टर्स और वाज इट राइट आफ्टर योर यूनिवर्सिटी कॉलेज किस तरह से था या सो जब मैंने मास्टर्स कर लिया था ना मास्टर्स के درمیان हमारे बहुत इंटर्नशिप प्रोग्राम्स थे सो आई हैड टू इंटर्न एट डॉट डिफरेंट प्लेसेस बिकॉज़ दैट इज हाउ आई कुड ओनली कंप्लीट माय डिग्री सो आई इंटर्न एट अ टीवी स्टेशन एंड अ न्यूज़पेपर and a digital agency advertising agency mujhe radio par nahi so there was a friend who was working there and she called me and she said sophia you have a very good pr so why don't you you know invite a lot of your your, your female friends and come more for an audition or could be they do theek hai maine kaha yaar acha maine kabhi socha nahi but at that part of time I used to listen to 89 and 91 both both the acha acha because okay. there are cool the english music bhi chalate the we're talking Pakistan about which year the, I'm talking about 2006. 2006. 2006. Right, yes. right, right. Yes, I'm ancient, Amar, but hey, I started young. Okay, <laughs> no, you better not, not get there. No, 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 no. So, so yeah. Um, so you know, then she called me over, and I gave an audition just like that, and they selected okay. me. And then the next thing I know, I'm hosting shows on the radio. So it just wow. happened. You know, just there to meet a friend, gave an audition, um, got a radio show, got so obsessed with it, got so good at it that I'm still mm-hmm. hosting shows after 16 years on the same station. Same station. I say, how does it mean? Like, how does it look like? Yeah, I mean, in a place you've you've spent like 16, 17 years with 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 FM 91, or and I mean, mashallah, it it's not an easy job to keep people hooked to your program. Yeah. I can I can tell you, yeah. एक शो घंटे का करना होना इट्स नॉट इजी टू हैव पीपल लुक एट यू फॉर दैट लॉन्ग तो मतलब 16 yeah. साल एक ही चीज करते रहना एंड हैव ए ह्यूज रीच अक्रॉस पाकिस्तान एंड इवन आउटसाइड पाकिस्तान हाउ डू यू डू दैट यू नो आई टेल यू रेडियो इज अबाउट पैशन सो यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट एवरी मीडियम इज डिफरेंट द डिजिटल स्फीयर इज डिफरेंट टीवी इज डिफरेंट रेडियो इज डिफरेंट राइट रेडियो में अगर आपके पास पैशन नहीं है और कंसिस्टेंसी नहीं है तो आप वीडियो नहीं कर सकते द ओनली रीजन आई वन ऑफ द लास्ट आई थिंक लास्ट पीपल स्टैंडिंग हियर ऑन द रेडियो साइड इज बिकॉज आई हैव बीन कंसिस्टेंट एंड बिकॉज आई एम क्रेजी अबाउट द रेडियो एंड आई एम नॉट अ कंटेंट क्रिएटर व्हेन इट कम्स टू रेडियो आई एम नॉट एन इन्फ्लुएंसर व्हेन इट कम्स टू द रेडियो आई एम अ जेन्युइन रेडियो पर्सन आई लव म्यूजिक आई लव इन बी फाइंड अ जेन्युइन रेडियो पर्सन लाइक समवन हु कम्स एंड हु गेट्स इनटू कन्वर्सेशंस लाइक लाइक दैट So they call radio is like imagine this that all you have is a mic you're hmm. talking to the wall there's nobody in the studio you are talking to the mic and there is there are no visuals right hmm. and you have to carry the conversation people have to associate your voice with something and what you think so you're a storyteller essentially hmm. you have to be good 
storyteller you have to be a good listener you have to play good music you have to engage with the crowd it is not about content creation it is about understanding what the other person's pulse is all about what the other it's about reading their heart as it does it require yeah. you know does this part of your life the radio part which is a huge one of course does this require a lot of reading every day learning new things every day staying updated all of those things like matlab yaar ye aasan kaam nahi hai maine apni video wagaira banani hoti hai i have to do a lot of research and it takes me so many days to do that you you recording a show every day so so that requires a lot of information reservoir to hota hai so like usme ye hota hai ki dekho shuru shuru mein to aapko balki aap aapko shayad hansi aayegi जब मैंने शुरू शुरू में स्टार्ट किया था ना तो आई यूज टू हैव अ स्क्रिप्ट इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी बिकॉज़ आई यूज टू गेट सो नर्वस एंड आई वाज लाइक ओह माय मैं आई डोंट वांट टू मेक अ बूबू ऑन एयर माय फ्रेंड्स आर गोना किल मी मैंने तो अपने दोस्तों को बताया भी नहीं था कि मेरे पास रेडियो शो है मेरी किट लग गई थी बट आई टोल्ड देम आफ्टर बट नाउ इट्स अमा इट्स लाइक इवन इन द मिडल ऑफ द नाइट यू वेक मी अप इन द मिडल ऑफ द नाइट यू गिव मी अ माइक एंड आई कैन क्रिएट अ शो फॉर यू अ लाइव शो फॉर यू सो एसेंशियली स्पीकिंग रेडियो में ये होता है दैट फॉर एग्जांपल अगर मैंने अपने शो की प्रिपरेशन करनी है सो देयर इज अ फॉर्मेट दैट आई फॉलो देयर हैज टू बी अ टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन सो द टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इदर हैज टू बी रिलेवेंट टू व्हाट्स गोइंग ऑन इन टुडेस डे एंड एज और इफ नथिंग इज गोइंग ऑन इट डिपेंड्स ऑन माय मूड all right or it depends on the weather but something that people can resonate themselves with right yeah. secondly the music i have to work on a playlist so okay. if it's themed then i have to think about the theme if it's a request show it's different okay. then i give related artist and song information that is also one of the things of being a radio person that you have to give related artist and song information ye nahi ki acha agle gaane ki taraf badhte hain enjoy kya matlab hai bhai who sang the song give us some history some interesting fact about the music you know yeah. some rumor and then i incorporate the weather forecast i have news headlines birthday shout outs and my most favorite thing is to talk to my audience mm. i make them feel as if i am a familiar stranger who's a friend that they can talk to so mm. i have people talking to me about their spouses right about their relationship problems about their work issues about their mental health issues uh. it's like somebody they're listening and they're not going to judge they're not going to judge what do you think are the other dark sides of it like matlab like, kaun sa प्रेशर आसान है कि नहीं क्योंकि मतलब जैसे भी खुद आपने बोला इन द बिगिनिंग यू डिडेंट इवन टेल योर फ्रेंड्स दैट यू आर रिकॉर्डिंग अ रेडियो शो बिकॉज़ यू डोंट वांट देम टू यू नो बी जजमेंटल अबाउट योर अबाउट योर वर्क एंड इट एंड इट हैपेंस मतलब मैं अपना काम आज तक आई हैव वर्क फॉर सम ऑफ द मोस्ट रिमार्केबल ब्रांड्स इन पाकिस्तान आज तक मैं अपना काम अपने अबू को सेंड करते डरता हूं because i know he will point something out or meri phir bhogi beizti and i take him in like I I put a lot of emphasis on that. So how do you like? Do right. You, don't you think it's a dark side of it, kid? That you don't have a lot of space for a lot of room for errors. Um. You know what? I think we should always have room for errors because by the end of the day, we do uh, have to realize the fact that we are human beings. But we have to learn from our mistakes. So if you make a mistake once, it's a mistake. If you make the same mistake twice, then that's a choice. that is not a mistake it means you ah. did not do your job well so shuru shuru mein maine sikha that okay what are my shortcomings i need to work mm. on my clarity mm. do i need to work on my accent do mm. i need to work on my pace do i need okay. to work on my music and this is something you always do whenever you enter a new dimension i would mm. say or okay. if you change your career and if you shift places then you have to adjust to the climate so shuru shuru mein to i learned from my peers i learned from the management i learned from the audience uske baad when i uh, got the grasp of the situation now i have become accustomed to it you know so now i know the the tricks of it all but obviously mm. you get to learn something every day is sense me ki technology nahi aati hai ha trends nahi aate hain ye cheeze aapko seekhne milte hain but the basics i have learned बिल्कुल 
if that person is not consistent or passionate about the radio that person is not going to remain on air for a long time i guarantee mm-hmm. you that you have to put yourself out there in the radio just check out all the famous radio show hosts why are they famous till now mm. because they've been consistent and passionate the passion. that's it mm. consistency is key yeah consistency oh kisi bhi aur paisa nahi hai bhai ye main bata du ye log bada acha laga tha video ka kya scene hai हाँ? <laughs> मैं इस बात पहले मैं भी इस बात में आने लगा था मतलब सारी लबी डबी बातें जो हैं रेडियो के बारे में हो गई अभी थोड़ा सा ये भी हाँ. मैं इस पे आने लगा था कि यार मतलब वुड यू एनकरेज यूनिवर्सिटी स्टूडेंट्स टू कंसीडर रेडियो वर्क एज 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 देयर फुल टाइम वर्क वुड यू वुड यू डू दैट बिकॉज आई रिमेंबर मैं अब नाम नहीं लेता मगर मैन आई वर्क एट 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 न्यूज पेपर इट्स कंसिडर्ड स्टिल कंसिडर्ड द बेस्ट इन पाकिस्तान आई वॉज लाइक मेरी यार यहाँ पे इंटर्नशिप हो गई है और मैं चला गया मैन आई वेंट इन साइड लाइक वॉट रिपोर्टर जो है इज मेकिंग ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड रुपीज अब थोड़ा बढ़ गया होगा टीवी पे आने वाले रिपोर्टर जो है इतना टेक्निकल काम कर रहे होते हैं इस पे गुजारा कैसे करते तो रेडियो पे मतलब पैसा वुड यू कर देखो अमार इंसान को अगर अपनी वर्थ का नहीं पता होता ना एंड इफ यू डोंट स्टैंड अप फॉर योर ओन सेल्फ नो बडी इज गोइंग स्टैंड अप फॉर यू सो यू फॉरगेट अबाउट पीपल डूइंग समथिंग फॉर यू यू फॉरगेट द गवर्नमेंट यू फॉरगेट योर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन यू फॉरगेट योर मैनेजमेंट यू फॉरगेट योर पीएस व्हाट आर यू डूइंग फॉर योरसेल्फ या व्हाट व्हाट इज योर एक्सक्यूज इफ यू फील दैट यू आर वर्थ इट एंड यू आर स्टिल इन द सेम ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ईदर यू मेक a courageous de- uh, decision of you know shifting away yeah. or you change your strategy or don't complain right so this is something i would that. say this depends on us mm-hmm. number one mm-hmm. because people will always abuse you people will use you and throw you away discard you like a used pe- uh, piece of paper if you don't yeah. stand up for yourself that is there acha radio mein ye hai ki again passion hai पैसा नहीं है पैसा तब आएगा वेन यू मेक अ मार्क फॉर योर सेल्फ एंड यू आर अ ब्रांड फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू आर अ वेरी नोन इन्फ्लुएंसर यू आर अ वेरी नोन एक्टर यू आर अ वेरी नोन सिंगर यू ऑलरेडी डन अ लॉट इन योर फील्ड यू एक्सेल्ड इन योर फील्ड एंड नाउ यू वॉन्ट टू यूटिलाइज द प्लेटफॉर्म ऑफ द रेडियो देन यू आर ऑलरेडी इस्टेब्लिश देन द रेडियो प्लेटफॉर्म वुड पे यू बिकॉज दे नो के रिटर्न ऑफ एमिसमेंट भी आएगा ऑब्वियसली सारे स्पॉन्सर्स आएंगे ठीक है आपकी मार्केट भी बहुत अच्छी है मगर अगर आप नए हैं और आप एक्सपेक्ट करें कि आई एम गिविंग माई एफर्ट एंड माई टाइम तो स्वीट हार्ट दैट्स नॉट गोन हैपन अंटिल एंड अनलेस यू वर्क सो हार्ड दैट यू क्रिएट योर ओन ब्रांड सो रादर देन कंप्लेनिंग आई वुड सजेस्ट बी पेशेंट बी कंसिस्टेंट एंड वर्क हार्ड जहां तक बात स्टूडेंट्स की है देखें रेडियो is a very good stepping stone because back in the day mm. there was only radio so jitne bhi aapke jaane maane adakar the they used to start their careers from the radio then they enter tv why mm. because radio mein aapko awaaz ka jo ek jadoo hai wo sikhaya jata tha jo bolne ka andaaz hai jo dialogue delivery hai the power of the mic gives you the confidence to rule the world man you can wow. have your mic anywhere in the world and you can be super confident True, right true, true, true. your tiktok tiktok's not going to help you i'm sorry but the mic is definitely going to help you because the yeah. mic will train you then yeah. the mic will be your mentor mm. so i would say to the students that please i radio mein sikhe audio work sikhe music sikhe content creation sikhe programming sikhe audience se baat karna sikhe aur patience or consistency ke sath chale taki you can create your own brand and then you can move towards events or tv or whatever patience and acha consistency matlab dono hi bahut key words hain yahan pe but like aajkal thoda sa ab lagta bhi hai and i don't like i don't disagree with this a lot lekin wahi wali baat jo aapne ki ke yaar if you are not being recognized as a certain organization you, there is no one stopping you you are the one who's going to have to manage your own brand and you can just get away if you want to if you are not making the kind of money then you don't have to force yourself on that seat to to wo ye to baat i i totally agree or uh, isme but 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 sorry to cut you but 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 i would also like to chip in agar koi majboori hai and you cannot leave 
यू ऑल्सो हैव एन ऑप्शन ऑफ डूइंग साइड हसल अपने ऊपर फोकस करो ना डोंट एक्सपेक्ट अदर्स टू डू इट फॉर यू यू डू इट योर सेल्फ यू आर योर ओन हीरो जस्ट डिपेंड ऑन योर सेल्फ यू कैन डू इट नो वन्स गोइंग टू स्टॉप यू नो वन्स गोइंग टू स्टॉप यू हां लेकिन यार वो नहीं है कई दफा देखा ना वो नहीं होता लोग नहीं कर रहे होते उस चीज को खुद से जो है वो इनिशिएटिव मुझे बहुत कम नजर आया लोगों में हो सकता है किसी पॉइंट में शायद मेरे में भी कम हो या आप कम हो गए हो या है बट आई डोंट नो मगर पाकिस्तान में शायद नई चीज करने से डर बहुत ज्यादा है यार इधर जाने का ऐसा होगा आई हैव सीन आई हैव कम अक्रॉस सम ब्रिलियंट पीपल ऑनेस्टली मतलब जबरदस्त मैनेजमेंट मैनेजमेंट स्किल्स जबरदस्त टेक्निकल स्किल्स इवन सम सम ऑफ दोस हैव हैड गुड कम्युनिकेशन स्किल्स एज वेल एंड येट दे वर स्केयर डाउन टू द कोर कि अगर हम अगली जगह चले जाएंगे वी वोंट बी एबल टू यू नो बी एज बिग अ हिट एज वी आर हेयर एंड चाहे हम यहाँ पे हिट नहीं भी हैं बट एट लीस्ट द मनी दैट वी आर बैंकिंग वो तो इट्स इन आफ टू मेक अर एंड्स मीट तो वो वाला डर भी होता है वो भी होता है प्लस आल्सो आई फील दैट टू वर्ड्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट हेयर कंफर्ट जोन we oh. have to get out of our comfort zone comfort we should zone. not let complacency take over ke uh-huh. jahan par baithe hain udhar hi baithe rehna you know what they say about a caterpillar caterpillar agar ye sochta hai zindagi bhar ke yaar main to bas khatam ho jaunga usko kya mm-hmm. pata ki in the near future the, you know caterpillar is going to be transforming into a butterfly and be able to fly mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. getting out of your shell getting out of your comfort zone transitioning mm-hmm. into something is a part of life we need to embrace change yeah. we need to welcome it we need to call it out you know we need it but sometimes it it's it is associated with a lot of unforeseen difficulties as well and you have to get to go through them mujhe lagta hai ki nikalna padega jana padega apne comfort zone se nikal ke lekin ye bhi hota hai ki sometimes when you leave a certain organization when you when you get out of your comfort zone only then yeah. you get to know your value in the market जैसे आप कह रहे थे ना कि अपनी वैल्यू बताना बहुत जरूरी है बिल्कुल मगर कई दफा ना लोग इसका गलत इस्तेमाल भी करते हैं जिस तरह अगर एक ऑर्गेनाइजेशन है वो आपको बहुत ऑलरेडी मतलब आपको वैल्यू देती है आपको वर्थ पता है उनको मगर फिर भी आप एक डिसीजन लेते हैं बिकॉज यू फील नहीं अगली ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ने आपको दो पैसे ज्यादा दे दिए या यू फील के नहीं यू वॉन्ट टू डू समिंग एल्स यू ऑल्सो हैव टू मेक ए सेंसिबल डिसीजन बाय दिन ऑफ द डे सो आई थिंक इट रियली डिपेंड्स but comfort zone se nikalna is very important in life otherwise we never going to learn anything new nahi that that is very true very true matlab kai dafa hota hai ki ek organization hai wo aapko aapke sath chal rahi hai jitna maximum wo kar sakti hai wo apna kar rahi hai and like ki nahi yaar maine wo maine wo nahi acha khair viral ye to ek to ek cheez ho gayi but let's talk about your radio experience again you have you have had conversations with so many people so many un yeah. unknown people matlab jante bhi nahi calls wagera what was the hardest ever call you that you distinctly remember yaar mujhe ye bhulti nahi ye bhulana mushkil hai you know so uh, there are uh, various incidents that took place in all these years i've had my share of stalkers also people who thought ke main unki oh. ek uh, haan ji kya kehte hain usko what is that word that you use for the soul what is that soul thingy Soul that you are my soulmate that oh my god you are my soulmate or you are my ah. future wife or you are my girlfriend yeah. and i have had stalkers come in from karachi from islamabad from all over the place and then i literally had to call the police and you know it it, no. it was really weird. yeah 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 but moving aside from the stalkers uh there was this very sweet call that i received once a month so i used to receive messages from an uncle Uh, who used to text me every single day when i was hosting my show and he used to tell me god bless you beta god bless you beta god bless you know some nice wishes and prayers and i was like assalam alaikum uncle thank you for tuning in how is your day do you want me to play a song for you how are you feeling um did you eat something yummy you know like talk to me about your day you know what he told me that he never texted me again because he left the country he said he lost his daughter and my voice and my personality reminded him of his daughter and he thought that while he was here in pakistan he was talking to his daughter on the radio and oh. every day he is tuning in and that just put such a i mean it put a smile on my face and i had tears in my eyes as well at the same time ke dekho awaaz ke sath itni association ho jati hai ki aapko lagta hai ki bas this is how i imagine this person to be yeah ye ye meri beti hai 
मेरी बेटी की रूह इसके अंदर आ गई ही टू टेल मी दैट आई फील दैट द सोल ऑफ माय डॉटर इज इन यू एंड शी इज टॉकिंग टू मी थ्रू यू सो योर रेडियो शो गिव्स मी होप दैट दिस टू शेल पास एंड अ न्यू फेस विल कम इन आई डोंट हैव एनी वर्ड्स अमर दैट वाज द मोस्ट ब्यूटीफुल एंड द मोस्ट हार्ट ब्रेकिंग थिंग एट द सेम टाइम सो इट्स इट्स इंसिडेंट्स लाइक दीस दैट मेक्स मी कीप गोइंग एंड देन आई हैव हैड Uh, people who've been suffering from depression anxiety mm-hmm. all kinds of mental health disorders and just listening to my show makes the day slightly better yeah that is what makes my day better that yeah. i am a little part of their happiness in any way that if they're suffering and i can make them smile and give them a certain kind of joy then allah has bestowed that power to me and i'm a yeah. wasila You know, yeah. I'm a vessel yeah. Yeah. for their happiness, so that makes me feel good. But does but does does that ever happen with you? That you know, when you come across so many sad stories, and of course, when you when when you are doing a radio show, people can at least send you a message and get connected with you like that, uncle. Um, but when you when you come across so many sad stories, does it, does the sadness other people's sadness ever take you over too? What's up? You know, uh, I feel that uh, I can say, and uh, let me just say it. I feel I am an empathetic person. I have mm-hmm. uh, a lot of empathy. Um, so, if I feel someone's reaching out to me, I feel that this is my calling, or Allah ne mujhe is kam ke liye bheja hai, and I have to solve that person's issue, mm-hmm. or I have to make a difference in that person's life. That is why that person has come to me. So, uh, I will give. a lot of attention to that person i will give my mm-hmm. energy but when i come back home then that's done so you are able, able to detach to yourself with, uh, from the radio yes. when you're back home yes And that's yes. also a skill yes. i'd yes. say yes because you know you have to train yourself otherwise so you will go a little i would say uh, darkness would kind of engulf you in a lot of ways and that's not healthy for you you have to alienate yourself वो सारे जहां का दर्द आपके जिगर में अगर वो आप लेके फिरे तो फिर आप आपका दर्द कौन बांटेगा आपके दर्द का इलाज कौन करेगा आपका दर्द आपका साइकोलॉजिस्ट करेगा और कौन करेगा बिकॉज़ यू साइकोलॉजिस्ट भी ना करते हैं बट लाइक डू यू थिंक दिस इज द डाउन साइड ऑफ इट कि कुछ लोग जो हैं जो कि रेडियो वगैरह या मीडिया पे आते हैं दे यू नो लाइक नॉट एवरीबॉडी इज ट्रेन दैट मच या जिसको पता हो यार ये बाउंड्रीज हैं और especially the ones who are now matlab jo jo students hote hain who are into their first jobs at a radio show or matlab unke liye to detach karna mushkil hai ha bilkul hai but that's where patience and consistency comes in na yeah. and you have to learn dekhiye you have to develop a certain kind of emotional intelligence amar and that cannot happen overnight and you cannot expect to change or make change otherwise overnight mm-hmm. you have to give yourself years you have to put in that hard work dedication loyalty you yeah. can not do anything without that you mm-hmm. have to be patient and abhi recently mujhe ek email receive hui thi one of my listeners sent in an email and he thought that i would be able to help he said that there is a girl who's in need of a shelter safe space for women because she uh, was being violently uh, being beaten up by her husband okay so ठीक है तो उसने क्या किया कि उसने मुझे ईमेल की बिकॉज ही थॉट दैट आई वुड बी एबल टू हेल्प जस्ट द फैक्ट दैट समबडी रीचेस आउट टू मी अमर एंड फील्स दैट आई कैन हेल्प देम इन एनी वे आई फील दिस इज व्हाट आई हैव अर्न्ड ऑल दीस इयर्स या दैट आई कैन डू समथिंग फॉर अदर्स सो ऑफ कोर्स फिर मैंने लिंक्स भेजे नंबर्स भेजे ईमेल की यू नो सो फॉलो अप किया सो दिस इज समथिंग दैट आई कैन डू एट माय एट माय प्लेटफॉर्म Yeah, exactly, and the kind of aura that yeah. you have, that being me, I am there to help whatever I can do in my own capacity. Yeah. That's why he reached out to you. Otherwise, मतलब कितने सारे ऐसे लोग हैं जो कि record कर रहे हैं show and मतलब कर सकते शायद ज़्यादा influential भी होंगे. But you know, there's a reason somebody reaches out to you and connects with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. So, so Baki, आजकल how how are things with uh, you know other things? मतलब एक तो radio हो गया. How are things with other things? अदर थिंग हाउ आर अदर थिंग्स गोइंग ऑन क्या चल रहा है लाइक मतलब आई आई सी यू होस्टिंग सो मेनी 
different uh, events as well the work as i said right plus you have you are an entrepreneur too you have a podcast facility mein lagta hai mujhe aana padega wahan pe so podcast aapko bhi sare podcast ab bhi shift karne honge please aur heavy lahor mein so i can i can do that with all the more reason for me to yeah. <laughs> so, i don't know why kaisa chal raha hai is it manageable You know, um, COVID ने तो आपको पता ही है कि बड़ी डिस्ट्रक्शन लेकर आया था कोविड हमारेबल फॉर एवरीबडी अराउंड द वर्ल्ड आई वुड से उसके बाद स्लोली एंड स्टडली यू नो वी एंटर अनदर डायमेंशन आई वुड से फिर स्लोली केम बैक टू लाइफ right yeah. um tai sai sai when start hue to main basically to radio show host too but i have started doing a lot of events in the past you could say a decade or so okay. so okay. event give me a high because i get to interact with the live audience mm. i get to interact with brands with companies they give they give me briefs um then obviously after i've been given a brief i have the power to be spontaneous and to create a show out of that brief yeah. so it's so creative right like mm. i've been given a few points and i just create a live show Yeah. and then obviously you get paid for it mm-hmm. and uh, you get to wear nice dresses you get to meet up with different people you get to network with them you get to learn something you get to travel across the country around the world i've been to thailand turkey usa uh, just for hosting shows and so i think um, yeah and i think that this is uh, part of my life that is very dear I love hosting events. TV mm. I've done. Um, I've enjoyed to a certain extent, but TV uh, I don't enjoy as such too much because live interaction. आप कितनी नहीं होती जिस तरह रेडियो पे होता है रियल टाइम में या इवेंट्स पे होता है. You can yeah. see faces. Mm. You know, instant reaction. So that's why TV uh, I don't enjoy too much as much as I enjoy radio and events. But Alhamdulillah, that's keeping me busy. And then my own studio I created because when a content creation ka hub kia tha because I learned so many things all these years. Yeah. And I tell you something: if you don't pass on this information mm. and you just keep it to yourself, to apka koi faida nii hai zindagi mein. Dunya mein koi faida nii. So I think we need to pass on the torch mm. forward, and also we should mentor young people now at this. age in our lives um because you've had that kind of experience and you can share that knowledge with people who can be mini sophies in the future or they can be fantastic hosts in the future on radio tv do events set up their yeah. own uh, business why not and you can rent out the space for your cool and private and public events as well this as well. that too oh mera kaha na this is yeah. important these days like uh one of the things that i um, am a huge admirer of is that you should have financial education because yes. uh, if finances theek nahi hote then it has a, a, that translates into so many other problems or wo mera khayal hai sikhaya bhi nahi jata although i know we're di- digressing from from the topic but it's important now that this has come up ke yaar aap matlab theek hai you're working you you you're going to a good job you're making money theek hai sab cheeze benefits wage rahe hain but what about your own stuff so ek to passion ho gaya but then there also has to be you know avenues for you to sustain your passion that can absolutely from, uh, making additional bucks and i'll tell you something we have to understand ke reality check milna chahiye ab dekho 16 saal mein jo gaye media mein i'm not getting younger day by day am i i also have to understand that you are <laughs> <laughs> I know I get that thank you um but you know maybe after 3 years or 5 years people wouldn't want to see me at their events because they have better options to be honest amar and that's okay you know we have to understand that so the reason that came up with thought, this by the way that's a scary thought honestly matlab one media person to another that's a very scary thought i don't know actually you know what It's not that scary, and I'll tell you why. Because I think we need to let go, because mm-hmm. that is the norm, right? Generation change होती रही है. अगर हम उधर ही टिके रहें, अभी भी हम जब हम यंग थे, हम कहते थे, यार ये क्या बीस साल हो गए इसको, इसने हिलना नहीं है, अगले बंदे को चांस नहीं देना. I think we should shift gears. We can pro- become producers. We can become content creators, curators, mentors. We can start our own business. Yeah, you know, teach people what we learn. and we need to learn how to let go i think we need to embrace change hmm. so that's why i came up with this idea because i was like let's give people a fresh chance hmm ha theek hai acha idea hai matlab like of course you're not going to be there that's everyone every one of us has to understand that we're not going to be yeah. there for for so many years like theek hai kuch saal ke liye hai especially and it's true with the media personality unna to kuch der ke liye hone hai then there are other people who going to take the baton ahead so, but i'll also tell you something 
So if you listen to a radio show at FM ninety one, okay, you will see all kinds of generation. I'm a millennial, right? And then you have Gen Z, okay. Mm. So mm. we have RJs who belong to Gen Z as well, and they are completely different from me. Ah, uh, yeah. And and same goes for me, and their audience is different because we cater to different audiences. Yeah. That's why you have to understand that a radio station now. has all kinds of rjs with different age groups mm. who cater to different audiences and this is how it's supposed Because to be yeah jo meri music sunenge jo meri baatein sunenge wo gen z shayad nahi hai wo abhi bhi millennials hai because they can relate to me mm. because you know i can relate to them because we have the same issues right <laughs> but maybe somebody who belongs to the gen z side would talk more about yeah. i would say climate change or harassment or gender diversity mm-hmm. gender being gender fluid because that's more relevant to them yeah for me it's it's probably something else so i think we have to understand that and move on in life move okay. on nahi yeah, aise mera khayal hai it's it's a good thought at the end of the day that you're doing something for for a certain number of years and then you know when new people come in then you can go on and assume something else in your role even yeah. at the same organization sometimes organize and as you have mentioned then you deal with different segments so kabhi jab when you were dealing with the teenagers or when you know uh um people in their 20s or 30s or is tarah se to wo ab ab of course uski segmentation farak ho jayegi and there's there's still gonna, there's still going to be a market for you and it's so silly like us then i was checking up uh, i think there was a facebook memory or something that popped up and i was like oh my god i can't believe i'm saying all these things on facebook like i would never do that now <laughs> so it's so really young man i'm like a teenager or maybe in my 20s saying all these uh, useless things yeah yeah, yeah. and i've never seen these things now and tagging people to our posts aur wo sari cheeze yeah. jeep kisan ke pictures lagana jinka aap koi tukni banda hai you are like yaar ye koi tukta tha main Yeah, and the posing and selfies looking horrible and thinking I'm looking like a queen and then just posing twenty five <laughs> pictures in one album <laughs> on Facebook. Yeah. Unbelievable. And one of the downsides of of internet is that whatever you post online, it's gonna stay there, even if you delete <laughs> it. I mean, the <laughs> platform doesn't there. delete it. I know, I know, I know. So that's there. Yep. Right, right. Thank you so much, Sophie. It's been such a remarkable discussion with you. Honestly, I was so looking forward to it, and I just wanted to talk to you about your experiences and radio and the work that you have been doing, social work, subculture. It's such a wonderful conversation. Honestly, I mean, I mean, I feel like I'm in the office. After that, I'm like, you have refreshed my evening now. <laughs> oh, thank you. I'm glad. I'm glad that I've been like a stress buster of sorts. It's yeah, good. Yeah. Welcome, welcome. Of course. And I hope we'll have another uh, chance to uh, to to record another episode of course and this time then we can have a one to one at the S studio, Mr. Uh uh uh. You have to come to the S studio for that. S studio. <laughs> S studio. Is it in Lahore? By? Is is it in DHA by the way? It is. It is at phase 5 H block. phase 5 wage block so so what if somebody wants to reach out to you I and mean, of course other people as well i may to connect ho gaya hu but what about other people uh wage block ke liye rahenge wo so i am there sophia anjum s o p h i y a for sophia a n j m for anjum on the right. social media platforms i have all my work over there the s studio is oh. also there on the social media platforms you can definitely get in touch with us over there no okay. worries at all Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Perfect. So I I wish you all the very very best with that, and inshallah, I know that we already bought the toga. Or, ah, I'm going to come and see. I'm going to record a uh, program there as well. Or so that out out that when season four comes, I think that there are many episodes we can. Look like I need to give you an offer. You can't refuse, Mister. <laughs> Got to work on that. <laughs> I am already sold. I can say. <laughs> But uh, I'd like to just mention one thing, Amar. एक तो ये कि keep up the great work. I love your content. Um, कभी ये मत सोचना कि पता नहीं it's not as glamorous or you don't have so many big celebrities who are viral. I think the kind of people you've uh, mostly chosen for your work have been doing great work for the society mm-hmm. and have been, I would say, torch bearers in their fields and they've been remarkable. So I think kudos to you for for making this happen. Just keep going. And two words. consistency and patience patience <laughs> 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 nahi honestly i had the i had a very unique privilege of getting into great conversations i i when you say that i think i, I it, it's also my duty to 
uh, recognize my previous workplace as well, Lums, which gave me that platform to record podcasts for their work. It was for their marketing uh, purpose. Of course, I, I get that. But at the same time, it developed a lot of capability in me as well. Yeah. And my Outlet with Amar is a product of the work that I was doing with Lums. So I also recognize that. And honestly, the guests who, who I have worked with, who I have had conversations with, including yourself, yeah. I consider my myself blessed to have gotten into those conversations and have gotten the opportunity to interview them. Honestly, I've learned so much. And ek to banda kitabon se sikhta hai, experiences se sikhta hai banda. Ek banda logon se sikhta hai. And especially jab aap itne logon ka itna cumulative experience ke baad jama ho raha hota hai, to aap shukar karte ho Allah taala ke yaar ki mujhe aisi opportunity mili, jo ki bahut kam logon ko Pakistan mein muyassar hai. That's so nice, but I would also like to give you credit over here because sometimes people don't want to listen and they don't want to learn, but you are willing to learn and you are willing to listen. So I think uh, you have that knack and that's wonderful. By the way, Lums me many teach me kiya tha. I mentored students. In yeah, Lums. I was going through your uh, portfolio on LinkedIn and I saw that yeah. CES me you had taught. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a fantastic experience. I had the best of times. I have become friends with my students now. <laughs> Uh-huh. Yeah. I hope you are still connected with them and you're going to uh, do another call. Yeah, yeah, I'm still connected with them. They're very sweet. Very nice. Yeah. Inshallah. Inshallah. I hope that you'll be in this place where further mulaqat hogi. And uh, Sophie, thank you once again for joining us on Out Loud with Amar. And uh, you. take care of yourself. You too. See you at their studio. Inshallah. Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz.